kind of kind of got up a little late this morning, to tell you the truth. I was up kind of late last night. Usually uh, on Sunday morning, uh, myself and my daughter, we walk to the donut store. We call it the donut store, you know, a little donut shop on the corner over here. We kind of got up a little bit late, so we uh, we all took a walk around the we all took a walk around the block and get out there and get some of that beautiful sunshine, man. Before I get too doggone hot out here, right? So uh, when I left, I was local talking, and the kids were making a little noise. So I said, come on, we'll go take a walk, come back, and damn, I had my beam pointed north. I went down to the Super Bowl, I heard a little bit of noise, swung my beam around. I was like, damn, we're getting some, uh, getting some TJ border in here. Let me get up 28, turn my beam south, and... There was Tijuana Mama. I was like, oh yeah, it's on. <laughs> it's on. Sound like the big bed? Hell, you know Mama, she gets in there and does her thing. No two ways about that. She broadcasts and uh, she gets it going on. No two ways about it. All right, big brother. Well, I'm going to step wide to the side. I'm sure there's a few others that must have to want to talk to you. <clears throat> talk to that big old bad station you working like you normally do. 4040, don't have to tell you, man, you sounded all kinds of good down here in the hood. Top of the Sunday, too, you grab it, what's left of it, and enjoy it. Well, Quack Quack Radio, working my little Fisher Price wannabe 23 channel break break radio. <laughs> I talk to you, bud, have a good one. Hi, right, Quack Quack. <clears throat> yeah, good to hear you, homeboy. You got a big hammer coming up here, too. Hey, man, uh, Head down to that break uh, in May, man. Be good to shake your hand. Tijuana Mama's gone. All the gang's going, man. String bean. And be good to be good to shake your hand, man. Bring the video gate. Get a video of us. And get some pictures of us, and we'll put it up on uh, on YouTube, man. Show all the good times we having. All right, homeboy, take care, love, peace, and happiness, Quack Quack Radio. You know who it is up north, working this PC-68, walking on through. Hey, 4040, let's see if I can get up in that cherry popper. Yeah, come on, String Bean. I think, now I downloaded a new program, same program, but a newer program. Oh my god, dude, I got so mad. I lost some great Watergates of me talking to Australia. <clears throat> I lost some awesome Watergates, dude. And that was it. I went and downloaded this new program. It's so far, so good. And I don't want to say nothing. But so far, so good. Come on in here, string me. Yeah, I gotta say, man, that was quite the bummer when I got online and I saw those three and you said, oh, I lost all those other ones and um, this is all I got left. And I listened to them and I'll be damned if you didn't have Big Phil and all the guys up on the hill. And Oh man, those conditions we had that day were phenomenal, man. That was just unreal. Well, I think we got them same conditions today. At least for so far, man, just talked to Tijuana Mama, Quack Quack Radio. I mean, we had some good long conversations, so uh, <clears throat> I think we uh, got some good conditions today, man, and I'm sorry about that. You know, the part was, I was on the radio that night going, damn, damn, it ain't working, oh no. And then I'm, 
I told uh, one of my homeboys here, I said, you remember me telling String Bean that I'm not going to post them all up? <laughs> I said, he's probably thinking that I'd have cut him all out, man. <laughs> Because I was only going to post like 15 of them out of the 33, you know. I was just going to dig through them and see, pick out the good ones. But uh, I'm thinking, oh, he's going to be, oh, you cut me out on purpose, Captain Bigger. But no, man, you had a big hammer, man. Just like you got going right now, String Bean, come on down. Oh, yeah. No, I knew what happened. I didn't think that. Um... As soon as I read what you posted, and then I saw the three that were there, I'm like, oh, man, what a bummer. What a bummer, because I know you had some good ones. Well, you are on a couple of those, man. I got the one, I posted the one with you in Little Sense, and I posted, uh, dude, it was weird. <clears throat> it was like the last, <clears throat> excuse me, like the last three water gates worked. And then there was one in the middle. I, I, I went back through, you know, and tested every one and there were a couple that worked it was weird it was weird so i hope so far so good like i said man this new program the updated version i think it was the program that was uh, messed up yeah 10 four. no i listened to the three that you had they were all great and i got the one with little sis yeah that was cool yeah 410 i mean i was glad to have you on there but like right now, man, you coming in here like uh, AT and T, man. I got only, I only have about 250 bird in the wire. Probably don't even need that much. I got uh, 250 birds in the wire. Yeah, well, you probably got about 150 more than me. <laughs> here we go. I'll put a couple more. No, I don't need that. Well, how about 200? I'll just put 200 bird. I don't need to be out there. <clears throat> with all that. 200 birds would get me there, huh? You were doing fine. You were doing fine. You didn't need to change a thing. Yeah, I'm, um, I'm like basically, basically mud ducking it. Doing about a third of what I usually got. My other thing took a poop on me, so got to get that fixed. But anyways, man, I heard you out there. I was on my way home from Costco, and I turned the radio on, and I'll be doggone if I didn't catch the, the tail end of you and Mama. And then Quack Quack got in there, and he fed you guys yak for a while. And you guys yak just long enough to make for me to make it in the front door and get in the house and turn my stuff on. See that? It was meant to be, man. It was just meant to be. <laughs> There's nothing worse than you hear somebody. I was taking my kid, uh, I was taking my kid to school, or picking him up from school, and I was in the mobile, and 65 WWPDX, uh, uh, probation officer was out there, and I was in my mobile one peel, and, oh, a lizard was getting in there, keen on me. I said, oh, that cop picker, wait till I get home. Wait till I get home, I'm only around the block. And then jump in the house and you know, you're praying, crossing your fingers that conditions are still there. I get in and 65 was 30 dBs in here and I just slap, put it on the lizard man and he's like, oh damn lizard, I think 4040's home. <laughs> I told him his talk show was over. Oh man. You, you know what? I so want to say something, but I don't want to. I don't want to overstep my bounds, so I'm just gonna let that go. Um, you know, when people like that are around here, man, the, all I say is, you know what, dude? Just give each other a hug and get it over with. Yeah, no doubt. Well, dude, I hear some of them nasty nickels he rolls. Dude, I just have fun with it. You know what I mean? That Captain Big E takes it serious. He takes that. He takes it serious to the heart, man. Me, I could, I just have fun with it and then roll on, get on out of the way, man. I had some fun with it, roll a couple funny fives, but now I can't be talking about I'm going down to San Francisco picking up money on the street and people are doing weird things to me. What the hell?